Hi, guys. Hey, guys. How you doing? Hopefully, everybody can hear us. Welcome to Drinking with the Davies. I'm Ted. And I'm Chris. And it is getting busy on the lake. Everybody's getting up here. The weather's starting to break. And, and there's people, lawnmowers going. There's lawnmowers going. People are getting their COVID shots. So now it's getting free for all. Woo! Crazy times. Uh, real quick, disclaimer, if you're under 21, uh, just move on. If you're over 21 and uh, you can handle an alcoholic drink, this mixology show might be for you. So check out what we're doing. Um, what are we making tonight? We're going to be making a cello driver, as Ted's named it. Cello driver, that's right. Um, and it's uh, it's not quite a vintage drink, but we think it's going to be... Uh, it's gonna, Our twist on a vintage drink. Yeah, I think it's going to go down in history as one of the... Davies drinks of uh folklore Davies folklore. drink folklore yeah i think so okay all right so we're also part of the uh, rising tide broadcast network uh let me just get you onto that page real quick we are proud affiliates of this creative group of people uh and please take a snapshot of this so you guys can see everything that we do seven days a week entertainment and education wise got a lot going on uh and i think we should get started with what we're doing huh get everybody out of this okay so um if you hear a bouncing ball or a toy running back and forth here and or little feet it's calypso so just bear with me i might have to step off screen and deal with the puppy She'll okay be fine. she's uh been wanting our attention though yeah so we're ready for the weekend and yeah what better way to between puppies and booze right that's Woo! right okay so um the history what we got today teacher well, so this is this drink is similar to a screwdriver. It's it's just kind of our twist on it. So um, the history of a screwdriver, um, I've found very little, um, but uh, it is said that the name has come from um, the tool, the screwdriver. Yeah. Um, that American oilman. Now I don't know if that's like people working on the oil fields. Okay. I'm not sure exactly what that means, oilman. Okay. Um, but I'm some kind of tradesman or something like that from American um, history. History. Well, history. <laughs> we haven't uh, we haven't started drinking yet, so no, just, we haven't yeah. yet. Uh, used to work use the the screwdrivers, the working end of the screwdrivers. They'd hold it by the handle and screw their vodka into the <laughs> juice cans. That's great. That's that. That's, that's awesome. the story anyway. I don't know how cool. true it is, but, um, um, and, uh, the screwdriver has been seen in many a movie, including airplane two, where, um, he's asked to take a panel off because I guess the, the airplane's having problems and he asked for a screwdriver and the flight attendant puts a drink in his hand. Gotcha. I'm glad it wasn't plumbers because that could have been really nasty. But it was just like oilman. It's good. Like a plunger. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> You're gross. Yeah, am I? Thank yes, you. you are. I appreciate that. Um, so I guess there are plenty of other variations on a screwdriver. Um, one of my uh, coworkers asked me just yesterday, I believe it was, when we were going to make a Harvey Wallbanger. And I said, well, I'm not sure. I said, I'm going to look into it and see what a Harvey Wallbanger is. Well, guess what? All Harvey Wallbanger is is a screwdriver with some additional... Alcohol. Um, alcohol, yeah. <laughs> and I forgot what the thing is called, but I'll find it here in just a minute. Anyway, um, other um, variances in uh, uh, the screwdriver mm -hmm. are a fuzzy navel instead of the vodka you use gotcha. peach schnapps. Gotcha. One that's called a hairy navel, you use the vodka and the peach schnapps. I've had one of those before. A brass monkey, nice. which is vodka, dark rum, and orange juice. Brass monkey. Oh, by the way, snacks. Hold on. Chocolate, Snickers, and Twix. Mm. So, we did. I, I failed on the snacks that's tonight. Okay. Actually, I, no, that's good. I was going to try and make something, but there's didn't no have all the ingredients. There's no feeling in drinking with the Davies. There's no feeling. <laughs> it's like there's no crying in baseball. Oh, okay. Right. Um. Right, watch out. So then they've also got a something called a cordless screwdriver, which is just a shot of vodka and a shot of orange juice. Okay. And then this one's my favorite name. Anyway, this one's called a Tang Banger. <laughs> it's vodka and tang we just boosted up our i know our views but of course nobody's made it since the 80s hashtag what was it called 
Tang banger. Hashtag tang banger. So you guys share this out. Please put hashtag tang banger. That would be um, awesome. Then there's the poor man screwdriver, which is um, vodka and sunny delight. <laughs> <laughs> New slicks. <laughs> Something like that. And then the That's electric funny. screwdriver, which is vodka, tequila, and energy drink and orange juice. Ooh, that could be heart attack. That sounds like something that Aaron would drink. Our son, yeah. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Then there's a slow screw, which is the slow gin and orange juice. And then a slow comfortable screw, which is <laughs> I love those. Southern comfort. I and love juice. slow comfortable screws. <laughs> They're awesome. Yeah. Um and sorry, then clip, so, sorry. a slow you're, comfortable you're screw up against the wall. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not kidding you. Uh, which is slow gin, Southern comfort, Galliano. Galliano is what's added in the Harvey Wallbanger. We'll talk about that in just a minute. Uh, and then orange juice. A lot of banging going on here. There is. A lot of screwing. A lot of screwing, a lot of banging. Uh, and then there's the slow, comfortable screw up against the wall, Mexican style. <laughs> slow gin, Southern comfort, Galliano, tequila and orange juice. And <laughs> these are starting to sound more like a, um, like a, what's the tea uh well there's a lot of teas what what tea the one that you just mix a whole bunch of alcohol and then you splash of coke oh in it. Uh, long island long iced island tea. iced tea yeah. long screw iced tea. <laughs> yeah <laughs> um and then there's the slow comfortable screw up against a fuzzy wall <laughs> which is slow gin southern i am comfort. so sorry clip so you're Galliano, too young for this conversation dude. peach schnapps and orange juice oh, you're way too young um, for this <clears throat> And then the last one, slow, comfortable screw up against a fuzzy pink wall. <laughs> slow gin, Southern comfort, Galliano, peach schnapps, sparkling rosé, and orange juice. Um, and then I also found out that there is a National Screwdriver Day, which is, is December there? 14th. December 14th. So get yes. that on the calendars, Brian, everybody else yep, is here. Yep, yep, Make sure that we all, Carl, make sure Donna knows that too. So, yeah. And then we'll all have a comfortable screw <laughs> up on a fuzzy, a fuzzy hall, pink wall. <laughs> a pink fuzzy wall. Anyway, wow. So <clears throat> that that Harvey wall banger that's that's the vodka, orange juice, and the Galliano. Um, I had no idea what Galliano was. But the, my coworker said he's he's a few years older than me, so he said my mom used to drink them all the time, and all I know is that there was a a bottle, a long, tall bottle of yellow liquid <laughs> oh God, that's a little disconcerting I right but galliano is the the thin yeah uh tall thin bottle and it is a liqueur mm -hmm. that has vanilla and anise uh flavor in it so licorice flavor <laughs> and this is licorice yes black licorice so um i i thought about hey since we did the limoncello yeah and we're working on the bitters which should be very bitter by now because i think they were only supposed to set a week and they've Ooh. been in there for close to three. Ooh. okay we'll try it <laughs> we'll uh we'll, we'll get em. that done this weekend though yeah we'll try um that. anyway so i thought well why couldn't we do the galliano you know yeah that's too. good with me yeah and so i looked up recipes because it said uh vanilla and uh anise with hints of other and so i wasn't sure what the other was and the only recipe that I found was kind of lame. It said just to make your simple syrup and add to it the vodka, uh, lemon juice, um, um, lime or what? vanilla extract mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. anise extract. Okay, that's kind of boring. But... Yeah, well, I thought that it was just kind of generic, you know. After having done this with all natural, sure. you know, fruit peels and all this stuff previously with the other things. So if we do try and do it, we're going to do the vodka. We're going to let the lemon peel, the star anise, and the actual vanilla beans mm -hmm. soak in that for a while. And then we'll strain it and we'll okay. add the simple syrup to That's it. That's cool. If we decide to go that way. But cool. I'm kind of looking into, I'm going to look into it a little bit more and see if there's anything additional other than the lemon peel, the, the star anise, and the, the vanilla beans. Gotcha. Cool. And then we have to find vanilla beans because that's the only thing I don't yeah, have. We'll make it work. Anyway. We got a full house tonight. Man, we got Audra, Dan, Brian, Carl, Lisa. Everybody's here. Gosh, everybody's here. It's crazy. Audra, we're drinking for you tonight. Yep. Toasting uh, Audra tonight. Uh, Actually, gonna... it's been a hard week, so right. we're drinking for a lot of things. Hopefully, tonight. this will help you cheer you up a little bit. So, um, always oh, never dull moment with Brian. Did you read what he said? No, I can't quite read from this. this what did he okay. say? Okay, we'll watch it on the playback. Okay. Because I think that just might be fun. 
as we're doing a slow screw. Maybe drinking slow screws. We're we're not though. We're drinking cello oh, okay. drivers. All right. Well. Right. I guess so. Right. Okay. Whatever you say. So are, you, are we ready to make a drink? Let's do it. Let's, Let's do it. Mix. Okay. So mix it. I'm doing this real classy this week, you guys. It's yep. just coming out of the carton. That's it. That's it. So. All right. So. Our recipe called the one that I found called for five ounces of orange juice and you got it. Yep. Two ounces of I'm gonna, I'll be vodka. Right back. I'm gonna make sure she's not getting into something that's but we're altering this obviously a little bit and so there's our orange juice. Okay. Cool. Yep. Here's our vodka. Remember, we talked about the vodka being made of different things, and right. since we're so, gluten free, we don't. So this is a potato vodka, and you can go back to the last few videos that we uh, did and check that back, you know, just to see a little bit more about those. We won't go into the full depth of it all, but it yeah. is potato vodka. Oh, you got, you got it. Okay. So uh, I used four ounces of orange juice, an ounce a ounce and a half of vodka, and we're going to use a half ounce. Of the limoncello and by the way guys um so this is how many weeks this is 10 weeks oh since geez. we at least i i couldn't tell you i lost track guys sorry too um, many too many cello if, if it's <laughs> too many limoncello shots right right if it's too if it's 10 weeks then that's from the very beginning right because right. because um it it hasn't been 10 weeks since we strained it and got the... That's cool. And that, you can you can watch the journey on that, too, how yeah. we made that with Everclear. And it gets... Every week, it gets better, though. It tastes so much milder. Uh, so you might want to add a little bit more than that, but that's okay. We'll, we'll see how it goes. I had the spoon already here, so... Yeah. I, we had everything here this yep. time. I didn't have to make him run for ice nope. or, or a spoon or anything. <laughs> Okay, so what's the toast this week? Here's to the nights we'll never remember with the friends we'll never forget. That's good. I like that one. Cheers. Cheers, guys. It is lovely. The lemon That's nice. just gives it enough so that I'm not a huge vodka drinker. I can always taste vodka in there. And, um, I, I can mm. still taste it, but I think that that lemon just mellows it out. That is awesome. That, yeah. That's really, it's all, it's really creamy. That is really good. I wonder if we, uh, if we did that with crushed ice, if we can make it like a, yeah, that's really good. Oh, oh, that was that's another, delicious. um, I did see somewhere that they were calling it a sonic screwdriver. <laughs> no. You get, um. <laughs> just keeps getting better. Sonic, the, you know, the drive through. Oh, I thought you meant the hedgehog. I'm like, that's the drive through the raunchy. restaurant. Yeah. You get your orange uh, slushy. Yeah. Yep. And you just add vodka to that. That's cool. In the parking lot. That's hey, awesome. Hey, if you really want to. That's great. I mean, anyway, that's good. Cheers. Cheers, babe. Here's uh, to everyone else this week. I hope you guys are having a better week. I know it's been rough for a lot of you. So cheers. Uh, this is really good. I, I suggest you guys, um, once you're home, not driving and not going to Sonic. Make one of these. This is delicious. So good. Um, mm. I was reading also, not like history, wow. but um, uh, wow. breakfast. A lot of times, brunches, they'll do yeah. uh, screwdrivers. I could see that with a little bit of champagne. It's too much, but champagne, it's kind of like a, mimo a little bit like a mimosa. I think I, ish. Well, that was it. One of them had a, oh, I guess it was a rosé, not a champagne. Mm. Yeah, that's a... That's a dangerous, because I think that's probably going to have some kick to it through the, you know, if you drank those in the sun during the day, I think that would probably bring out a, yeah, very unique uh, personality change. <laughs> a lot of people, that's really good. Possibly. That's really good. Um, That was awesome. Thanks. Um, Very well done. That was awesome. Um, I want to thank everybody for this week, uh, for the last few weeks with the Kickstarter. It has been awesome. We've, uh, Completely funded uh, right out of the gate. Um, 
And uh, right now, I think we're at we're at 53 backers and over $2,300, which so thank you guys for uh, making that happen and being part of the journey, sharing it. And just uh, we appreciate it greatly. Uh, it's going to be rounding out Sunday. So we're almost you got a couple more days to get everything uh, wrapped up. If you're going to be part of it. You can check that out on uh, the Kickstarter, uh, Ted Davies Artistry Grim 101. And I'm, I'm not going to bore you with the video again because everybody's seen it so many times and it's uh, it's a great video. Uh, but I want to make sure you guys are show we're showcasing the drinking with the Davies right now. But we really, really do appreciate it. Next week, um, we're going to see how it goes. We got a couple things going on Friday next week. We're going to see if we're going to pre-record it possibly. It's our first time doing it, so I don't know, if, I don't know what we're going to do yet. But we've got uh, a couple things going on with Calypso, and we want to. That's kind of a priority, uh, you know, than what we're than what we're doing here. So, and she's got something. Give me one second. Keep talking, baby. She's six months old now, and it's time to take her in and get her fixed. I don't know so, what she got. Um, the keg or something. we're hoping that she's gonna get through it just okay. fine, and that she'll be back home with us Friday night, but, um, right. She's just eating egg. <laughs> so the, anytime she goes for anything, she takes it in another room. I just want to make sure she's all right. So, okay. Sorry to bore you guys. All right. Anyway, that's, you know, life in the Davies household. So <laughs> that's why we have drinking with the Davies. <laughs> but thank you guys yeah. really for stopping in and seeing us. We have fun with this every week. We do. And, and we got a lot of things planned for the summer. Uh, there's going to be uh, outdoor events, and, and possibly some guests right, stopping by. Right. So we'll have uh, and such. Yeah. We'll have <laughs> dropping in drinking with the Davies probably is what we're gonna do. And it'll be a lot of fun though. So we we'll have, have a lot of characters. We have a lot of characters around here. I think it should be a lot of fun. <laughs> um and Jeffrey Hayes too. Hey Jet, what's up, man? Where's the tip jar? Dude, is that no, not right now. Maybe later. Maybe later. But <laughs> thank you though. You guys have a great uh, weekend. Be safe. Um and yeah, I mean, that's, that's it. It's pretty much a wrap. And let but, us know which kind of uh, screwdriver version yeah, that you guys and, make. And <laughs> where you guys drink it, if it's in a pink hallway up against the wall or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> we got to go because we and have to. slower slow or we're not. <laughs> or a slow screw, whatever. So yeah, we'll talk to you later. Have a great week, guys. Let me find that. Can... I'm pretty frazzled here. I don't know how I'm going to find a video here. Bye, guys. Have a great week. <laughs> 